going everybody Alfred here back with another video on final fantasy 16 hope you guys are ready we're gonna go into the hideaway last part we saw a lot of the cruelty from the the black uh guard the black whatever they're called only the founder knows what awaits so, us in the iron kingdom but vivian could probably make an educated guess we'll find do a we'll, we'll. about these damage so from my understanding the pluses are very special we'll see. back again lord rosfield i'm touched that you should find <sighs> it is not your company but your ca <sighs> what will it be today then the iron kingdom You'll soon be setting sail for Drake's the Mother Crystal that rises. There was a time when a true-blooded Rosarian had only to brave the waves to visit it. But then the I Story time. As you know, the Iron Kingdom rules over the islands to the west of Storm. Or rather, its church does. But this is not the pragmatic approach to state religion employed by the Holy Empire to manipulate the masses. No, the Iron Kingdom is the literal embodiment of the crystalline orthodoxy. And so, if one is to understand it, one must start there. As the name implies, the orthodoxy holds the Mother Crystal sacred. And they do not take kindly to heathens plundering the objects of their worship for the means to fill wash tubs and light lamps with frivolous feats of magic. Damn. Indeed, the faithful consider ether a sinful thing, a poison no less. And to them, a dominant is an instrument of evil, albeit one they have proven only too happy to turn against their enemies. Some 80 years ago in Northern Storm, Drake's eye collapsed. Soon after, in pursuit of Aether and with the Blight at their backs, the Northern Territories descended upon the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. And when the Shields of the Flame marched north to meet them, the Iron Kingdom spied an opportunity. A few short days later, the Crusaders landed on the island of Mount Drastanus, home of Drake's breath, and plucked it from the Duchy's grasp. Rosaria tried to reclaim it, of course, but to no avail. I doubt more than a handful of duchy men have set foot on its shores in your lifetime. Nor are they like to again, under the Empire's stewardship. Meaning the Iron Blood will keep their island. And with it, the foothold they need to march on mainland soil when next they spy an opportunity. Yes. Damn, son. The Mother Crystal is both the object of the Iron Blood's worship and their gateway to the continent, making Drustinus the holiest of holy grounds, from which the Orthodox Crusade shall one day sail for my father and my grandfather, both traded blows with the Iron Blood for control of Drek's breath. Had things unfolded differently at Phoenix Gate, we would have sent our entire fleet against them. But instead, they sent their fleet against Rosaria, sacked the capital. I'd say you'd be forgiven for wanting a little revenge. Ben. Thank you. All. There you go. All right. So now we Not have. Much else to do here. Oh. Let's see if Jill's ready. Typical noble. Ready? We'll be over soon. You ready? I think so. Jill. When you told me you had to come to terms with you weren't talking about destroying Drake. No. I spoke of Imran. The leader of the Crystalline oh. Orthodox. The man who made me do all those unspeakable things. I'm going to kill him. It's what I need to do to put the past behind. And I know that I can do it. Always. And I'll be beside you, too. All while Sid looks on. We'll make him. Damn, she's straight said I need to kill him. He needs to die. Okay. Let's go. Let's 
Hold on, what the hell? Is that something coming down? It's a boat. Is it hot? Useful trick. Freezing and throwing the spray to make mist. How did you learn to use your powers like this? The Masters made me do it. When the Crusaders took to the seas to keep the fleet's movements from prying eyes. Damn, son, she was used like crazy. I'm fine. No, you're not. You also turning crystal? This may be the only chance I get to go back. My only chance to put things right. I have to do this. Whatever the cost. All right. She is the Iron Kingdom's mother crystal. Mm. Drake's breath. Why is it shaking? Is it going to be hot here? Probably. Strong currents, sharp rocks, and ether floods. Let's not forget them. This island is a natural fortress. But safety breeds complacency, allowing a single rowing boat to slip in unseen. Yep. The sanctuary is inside the mountain. If we follow the old trail, we should be able to enter by the back gate. All right. Let's go. Fire and ice. You're referring to them too? I always imagined when I came here it would be to reclaim it. It used to belong to Rosaria, didn't it? Once, though it's been in the Iron Blood's clutches for far too long. As was I. For 13 years, this rock was my home. I know its secrets only too well. This path was abandoned after an ether flood. They don't guard it anymore. The perfect little shortcut. Come on, son. Get out of here. And the only way to this one. Easy peasy, son. Why is our dog doesn't get affected by this? Was that an earthquake? They happen all the time. That wasn't even a bad one. It's nothing to worry about. This Kill! 
into the case from there. What is the upgraded for? Details. Oh, I can just assign it to anyone. It doesn't give me no power boost or nothing. No point. I don't have enough. I don't have enough of this. And not this. Okay, that one for sure I will get. Master this, do this, upgrade. No? Thank you. 
press on? Yes. the volcano. You get used to the heat, though I don't remember it being quite this hot. There are monsters. Was that what cause for concern? It was. And they're getting bigger. Something oh. I had to come back in order to finish him off, huh? Good trap, 
son. Fuck. Is there no other way across?
was like a boss fight. early on in the game but it was not a flame lizard it was just a regular one
just hot. Thank you. A bit of water? Quite a commotion our friend made. Let's hope the guards didn't hear it. The gate to the inner chambers is just up there. Then we make for the sanctuary. I need to finish this. Before the heat finishes me. Here, yeah, yeah. here. We'll enter the Comric by the Handmaiden's living quarters. It was always a hive of activity. Sounds like we'll have a hard time staying out of sight. We won't have to. There's someone there I should very much like to see. Okay. Get in. Lady Marley, it's me, Python Butha. Jill, it can't be. It is, my lady. I cannot talk here. Come with me. Oh, what the hell? What's that handsome man doing out here? You're safe. And I, you. Why ever would you risk coming back? Are you a fool, girl? Or have you grown tired of your freedom already? Forgive me, my lady. But I had to come back. There are things I left undone. Tell me. Where is the Patriarch? Oh, means to kill him. Can't tell you. At this hour, he'll be in the Comric, giving thanks. Shh, it's just the, the name of you the mean... Patriarch. Oh, fiend! Clive, we have to get to the Sanctuary. Now. Lady Marley, you must flee this place, gather your things, and go. Now listen here, Jill. In Iraq, no. We have company. <gasps> This passage, it leads straight to the Comric. Go on, stop dawdling. Thank you. You were always so kind to me. My light in the darkness. Take care, my lady, please. You deserve better than this. A long and happy life, promise me. to die, son. I'll live if you promise to do the same. Oh. Uh, 
Don't worry, she's not she's not gonna live, man. Come on, Clive. We're nearly at the Comrec. All right. It's our welcoming party. I've had enough of their hospitality. Sides? No. How many of them are there? Two. Where to go? 
Yep, that is the way to go. Hold on to that money first. Clive, there's something I need you to know. I saw the Patriarch do things no one should have to see. And so I swore that he would die by my hand. I understand. I faced my demons. Then you must face yours. Understandable. Okay. This is it. See what we are at. Mm -hmm. Master it, just add it to every other slot. That is a good one, though. That's what I do need. Uh, what is a master? Uh, increased claw range. Yeah, I'll go for that. Uh, master for this is just uh, an assignment spot. Patriarch. Oh, is he anything? I want to know. Oh,
Jesus' name. Crazy as hell. Shiva's dominant. Come to beg forgiveness for your failure. For years, I followed your orders, fought your wars, all to protect the children you took, just as you took me. And what did you do in return? You put them in chains and you slit their throats! Fiend. <laughs> Their souls were sullied with the stain of ether. I merely cleansed them of their corruption. A Even penance that. paid, just as the Holy Mother wills it. Repent, abomination, for a monster like you to set foot in the Holy Cymric is in itself a crime deserving of death. You need to die. You're right. I am a monster, and my soul is stained black. Though not by ether, but by the evil of men like you, who made me close my heart and drown in darkness when I should have raged against it. This is my penance. I will be your monster no more, nor will I suffer you to create another. <laughs> Does the beast bear its teeth at its master? Master. Come then, dominant. Rage. Be as you have ever been. A monster! And what are you, Imran? I was forced to kill. You do it by choice. But never again. I bowed to you once. Now it is you who shall bow to me! Oh. Kill them. No, that's bad. in the back. What's going on here? 
What can I do? But a simple dog. Come on, bro. Why? Why can't I do it? Oh, you gonna fight me? Just one. Oh, you got some power. Okay, go super sense for a little bit. I'll go back forever. We better make this quick. Oh, no. No! Yeah. 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 
I'm running out of lot of stuff here. to die. The lame dude was hard. <laughs> Jill! <laughs> I'm going to finish this, Clive. like her power so she's like go that man the guy Hold on, hold on. Who conducts with your holy sanctuary the Jake's Hold on, Jill. May the blessing of the crystals go with you. It's over. It is. And Shiva exacted her price. She did. Again, the burden fell to you. And I bore it willingly. This was a sin for which I had to atone. Now I can continue at your side with my head held high. Somebody here. Did that? He's like, let's go.
Clive, look. It's just like the one at Phoenix Gate. Damn it. We need to leave. Agreed. Bro, who, who are you? Ancient mural. A wall painting in the on the depths of the apotry. tree. Okay, created for what purposes? So being in the lost long. And now you keep yours. Legacy. Let me turn the corner. Oh, it wasn't him. This way, Your Grace. <laughs> he takes down the thing. He protects him because of Ultima. You're bleeding. I have a tonic which will. Uh, I thank you for your kindness, truly. But I assure you, I will survive. Please. Save your medicines for those who need them most. Oh, well, if you're sure. For a moment there, I felt my brother's presence. You did? I fear he is in Ultima's thoughts again. But why now, after five years of silence? Because he destroyed the crystal. I cannot keep him sealed away much longer. Your grace. No, do not dirty your hands. Look at them all. Like a river flowing to the sea. Or moths to a flame, perhaps. The crystalline dominion, their light in the darkness. More and more lose their homes to the blight and set out in search of sanctuary. While others lose their fortunes to the Dalmechian levies and leave to find new livelihoods. What is it that you seek? In the Dominion, Your Grace. Oh, Dion Lesage. You mean the Crown Prince of San Breck? He has many titles. Dion the Bold, Prince of Dragoons, Odin's Nemesis, or simply Bahamut. I met him once when we were children. He was a chivalrous soul even then and has served his empire indefatigably ever since. And you are confident that he will listen to what you have to say? Our world lurches ever closer to the abyss, and a hidden hand ushers us onward. Ultima's influence extends to every nation, Sunbreak included. If His Highness is the man I believe him to be, and I pray that he is. This truth will not have escaped his notice. <sighs> A 
As the mother crystals fall, the eternal flame wavers and the azure sky begins to bruise. How lucky we were to be blessed by the crystals, and yet how spoiled, like canaries in a gilded cage growing fat on seed. But now, the bars are closing in, and we must take flight. Painful though it be to leave our home behind, it is what we must do to be free. Which is it that men cannot live without? A blessing that leads to damnation, or a freedom that leads to deprivation? I do not yet know the answer to that question. Do you, Clive? <coughs> Your Grace, let us find a place to rest a while. We can return by the Dalmechian Trail once you have recovered your strength. I realize your duty is pressing, but if your health should fail... I know. Thank you, Yota. Where's she from? Now that we have a name. Armies attempt to breach the Empire's defenses and gain the Isles of Ark has failed yet again. Only because your fleet has proved as impotent as a eunuch on laying night. Damn. Would you rather we simply fell back to the capital? Enough, both of you. All here agree that the Empire cannot be allowed to maintain its illegitimate claim on the Dominion. However, our casualties mount with each passing day. There is a literal sea twixt you and your prize. The armies of Sambrek need but sit back and watch as you harmlessly lap against their walls. They are dug in like ticks and seek to draw out this siege, knowing the capital's stores are nigh bottomless. And what of our wise rulers? Goaded into war without any thought as to what chaos it might reap. Republican soldiers starve while waiting for orders from Randalar. If you would but take the field, their bellies would be full by nightfall. If I take the field, so too will Bahamut and our duel will shake the island to its foundations. Instead of liberating the Dominion, you would doom it to destruction. Unless that is what you desire. Uh, uh, very true. If our family. learned advisor has a solution to propose, we should be glad to consider it. Hmm. Is that the Emperor's? What is the meaning of this, Lord Kupka? What it means is that I am disinclined to advise you any longer.
What is she doing there? Ah, the looks on their faces when you walked through those doors. A perfect picture of stupefaction. They could not believe their eyes. Though I confess, I had my own doubts whether or not you would accept my invitation. Such shocking news. Sid isn't a son of a whore. He's the son of an empress. Your own dear Clive. Absurd. Who fed you these lies? Oh, that's it. I have never spent a moment among criminals, save at the gallows. I came here with my son. Not to entertain your baseless accusations, but to put an end to the senseless hostilities between our nations. Very well. You need only agree to the terms I set out. Sid took the life of someone dear to me. A woman by the name of Benedicta. I swore to take his in turn. This would not be... Disagreeable to you, I take it. You would finally be rid of the stain on your noble name. In return, I will leave Sandbreck in your capable hands. Your Imperial Majesty. You ever care about bowels or title? And all for the love of a common whore. <laughs> Dominant or no, one cannot hide one's breeding. And beasts will ever belong with beasts. <laughs> there are greater things in store for you, my darling Olivier. Soon enough, you shall be the crown prince of Sambrec. And when your father goes to meet Great Grieger, you shall be emperor of all you survey. The old order shall come tumbling down, and you will rebuild the world in your glorious image. I very much dislike <laughs> her. I... Soon. Hmm. All right, after this cutscene. She's been in there for hours. Something must be wrong. All right, guys. That is it. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'll kids.